All right, so let's do a quick walkthrough of how to upload an ad to Justin's. Going to want to go to justins.com uh, and you're going to go to my school store if you are logged in. Uh, we're going to pick Gustine High. Down here, if you scroll down, you have yearbook recognition ads. We're going to click on that, type in our student's name. Now we're gonna choose what size ad we're gonna go with. We're doing the full page ad, so we'll click on that one. Now, they have all their options, and two of the options are uh, full page ads. It looks to me as though this is a ad that has a border, a white border around the edge, and that this one is going to be a full page spread. I'm not sure why they have another full page spread down here. But we're going to pick, let's pick a full page spread. We can do that or you can do it with a white border if you want. So this says over here that you can drag and drop. I have not been able to get drag and drop to work. So what you're going to have to do is click on upload and agree to the terms. We're going to go to uh, our my device. And you're going to find wherever you have your file saved on your computer. This is an important thing. Make sure you are selecting the final version. Um, I always label my final output as final uh, in big capital letters. Uh, in, you'll see here, let's see, let's hover, hover over this. Uh, this file you can see is 8.2 megabytes in size, whereas one of the proofs is uh, 617 kilobytes. So there's a big difference in the size of the file um, and the quality of the output. So make sure that we're doing the final and not one of the proofs. If you have them in the same spot, we're gonna open that. So now that it's uploaded, you select OK, and we just drag that over and drop it right onto the page. Because it's a full page ad and uh, a full page spread, it's going to, oops. Now, while you are in there, if you happen to accidentally hit your scroll wheel, uh, it changes the perspective. I don't know where the image goes, but if you lose your image, uh, you cannot find it just hit the minus button and it will bring it back you can only apparently use uh the plus or minus buttons to zoom in and look at things on the page uh so make sure everything looks right uh it looks like our bleed is fine i have provided extra room on the side so the reason we put a little extra room on the side is for the printing over the edge of the page if they need that and there we go. We're all set. And uh, at that, after that, you save your image. And then you go to preview and buy. Uh, we noticed you have not run spell check. We don't need to run spell check because everything has already been spell checked. And uh, it's already, it's just an image. So there's no text. All right, so once we get to this stage, this is very important. Make sure everything is the way you want it. If you need me to make any changes, let me know and we'll get those changes made. But once you click I understand and purchase ad, then you are on the hook for this. All right, and you're all set to go. So if you have any questions, uh, don't hesitate to ask. If we need to make any last minute changes, just shoot them on over to me and we'll get that done for you. All right, and... That'll do it.